some lunch. site of Fort Steele. Steele, here in Wyoming. I'm going to show you a couple of things. I guess the start of uh, Fort they say, excuse the wind, is beyond north of the tracks there. I don't know what's in here. This is the bridge tower's house. Welcome, come in. Oh shoot, it's open. Oh, nice. Wow. Check this out. I'm impressed. Impressed here. Miami, this is open. This is the uh, the uh, bridge tender's house. I guess in the old days, the bridge over there, outside it, you can see above my uh, the motorhome there. I don't know if you can see the tracks. This is the bridge. This is guy that tended the bridge. How cool is this? Looks like it looks now. I mean, this house right here, the bridge tender. The bridge tender's house was built during the late 1860s. It's, uh, I guess it's one of the structures constructed by the fort, by the railroad. The other two were the train depot. Watched how the house of the South served as a surveillance point for a railroad employee called the Bridge Tender. <laughs> His duties were this: was respond to fires, floods, and debris that you know. They basically watched the bridge to make sure nothing, uh, you know, nothing uh, messed up the bridge. Hmm. A little postcard, cool. Hmm. And then he looks out the window and he goes, hey, there's a uh, fire down here. I got to get going or call somebody. <laughs> cool. What a job. Bridge tender. And this house is in good condition. I mean, obviously, there's some electric up there. What do we got in here? Oh, there's a little thing in there. Let's see if this is open. Nope, it's not open. Oh, it's a sink and his table with the <laughs> dishes on it. Oh man, this is really cool. Looks like a bunch of uh, sunflower seeds on the ground. Birds must have got in there. Some idiot left it there. Hold on. Wow, this is pretty pretty cool. It's like a two bedroom. I can't can't beat it. No siree. Hmm. Oh, a little storage area there under the stairs. Where you keep Fred, or whatever that movie was. <laughs> There's the entrance. And like I said, the guy probably in his bedroom right here, his room right here, he sat and just uh, checked out the bridge right there. See what was going on. Very cool, very cool. The river's over here. Oh man, I'm really liking the bridge tender's house. I might have to get Buddy Seller to come in here. We spent a night here. Hmm, interesting. A bunch of uh, information about Fort Steele right here. Cool. What's down here? Gotta watch for snakes. Hmm. Interesting. There's your tender's house. That is pretty darn cool.
get that generator going with the AC. Cooking up some chicken for uh, lunch here at the historic site of Fort Steele in, uh, Missouri, in uh, Wyoming. Sitting over here, got the AC Pendy going with the generator, and there's the uh, bridge tender's house. Here's the bridge, the river, and the fort supposedly on the north side of the bridge, so we'll have to check it out. Here's the railroad, Western Pacific, running right past Fort Steele in our little boondocking spot right now until somebody kicks us out. Right by the river, baby. Pickles, cranberry, and some baked beans. Fourteen foot clearance. The motorhome can make it under this. river down there baby how do I get to that low area and take advantage of this cool I guarantee water oh there it is wow I'm a little worried about leaving the dogs there but can't pass this up Standing on the edges of Fort Forge Parade Grounds, once used as the activity in space, place soldiers train for military ops. Huh. Many buildings, foundations, I guess. Parade Grounds, enlisted men's. All those two uh, pylons there, you can see one there and one there were the entrance building to the enlisted quarters. That is so cool. Then you have the quartermaster's building over there in the back. And, uh, wow. A lot of, yeah, it's all down now, but pretty cool. Wow, look at this. You're standing, or I'm standing, where men have run around getting ready for war, you know, just 
unbelievable the feeling. Just so great the feeling to quartermaster's barracks is back there. I'm not gonna go running around too much. We got the dogs in the car, so it's just awesome. This is the enlisted men's quarters, that foundation right there. Listen, men's barracks. That's what it looked like before. Cool. And, uh, so, you know, I don't want to get bit by a snake running around over here, but cool. These are the corners right there. Look, you see the little posts right there. This foundation was for the listed quarters. Wow. Love to come back here for uh, when it's not so hot. It's 100 degrees today, dang it. But uh, what can you do? It's just so beautiful. If it wasn't 100 degrees, I can hang out and just go over to the quarters, go over to the quartermaster's thing. General, Major General Trouble, and he was in charge of this fort from 1860 to 1897. He was riding, while riding along the line, recruits arrived this, the day before this post. My horse was reared so violently that he fell back on me, then kicking, struggling, and finally turning completely over while I was under him. By most extraordinary chance, I escaped without a limb or bone broken. Hmm. 1872, he sent that text out. The war, I guess it, uh, the command defended itself. Sacks of flour, wagging dead horses, as Ute Indians rained bullets down from the bluffs. The battle that raged from about noon, September 1879 until 8, 1879 until 8.30 that night, 12 of his men inflicted numerous casualties upon the Utes before peace was restored. If you can accompany me. Hmm. Heading out, away from Fort Steele's bridge tender's house. Thank you, bridge tender, for the hospitality. trains that they were talking about earlier well it's obviously it looks like a recreation of one this is uh it's like come um, some kind of guard. yeah oh this i saw this in the other this was a guard tower that for the end when you drive you know when the horses are coming people can hey here come some indians <laughs> That's a car tower. That was my great impression of uh, a soldier hanging out in there. Here comes some Indians. I'm going to be checking out the uh, Fort Steele uh, barracks information and a little historic site off of Wyoming. Right down here in Fort Steele, Wyoming. I guess you get off the, uh, it's on the 80 west eastbound area. Just take it down there right when you get into Wyoming a little bit. And then you'll uh, see things as Fort Lee historic site. Thanks for watching, subscribing, liking, and I'll see you down the road.